The leadership of Atiku Youth Wing has pledged to bring to fruition the presidential ambition of Atiku Abubakar, the standard bearer of the People's Democratic Party, PDP. The group made this known during a Christmas carol of nine lessons in collaboration with Atiku Care Foundation in Abuja. The Director General of the Voluntary Political Organization, Odi Roland, while speaking on the sidelines of the event, explained that Atiku's One Nigeria campaign speaks volume of his desire to bring support to Nigerians. Other stakeholders are convinced that with Atiku as a de-tribalized Nigerian who has an edge over other presidential candidates. I must tell you today, most of Atiku's friends are from the South. So if Atiku can live with his friends from the South, and to today, he's still close to his friends, it means the man is a lover of peace. Today in our country, we, we are more divided than ever. So for now, we need someone that can unite us. His appointment, even as uh, a private person, not a government official now, in his house have been people from different different tribes so there is actually one can attest that he is a detrapalized man and that he has proven over time and his activities has also proven it the appointment he has made and uh, uh, from the past to the present anyone who wants to be honest about Atiku Abubakar will tell you that he is not a religious fanatic Oh yes, you say Atiku is not young, but I say he's young because I think age is just a number and it has to do with within and inside and how you feel and the zeal and enthusiasm you have to do the job you're going for. So I think Atiku Abubakar does not only stand a chance, but Atiku Abubakar come 2023 will be sworn in.